and welcome to what I guess could be called the second season of DCI with the Clicks. Last year, we took you along our journey as a family throughout the entire summer, and we wanted to do that again this year. We've had some changes, and then some things are the same. But as you know, no summer in DCI looks identical. And so we'd like to take you along again. Let me introduce our family. Don is the program coordinator for the Colts. He's been with them since I believe it's 2019. And he was part of the team that last year got the Colts back into finals. I am so excited for you to see their show this year. The concept is so cool and I've gotten to hear the music as the arrangers have turned stuff in and now as the core is in uh, spring training, I've gotten to hear some of the clips of them actually playing in context and it is just amazing. I'm so excited for you to see the Colts this year. Dawn is with them most every weekend, um, flies to them wherever they happen to be on Thursday and usually back on Monday morning and spends as much time with the Colts as he can. Next, we have Avery. Avery is our son who turned 20 last week. He played marimba with Carolina Crown last year, and this year is also playing marimba, but with the Cavaliers. I'm really excited for Avery to get to be part of this anniversary season with the Cavaliers. Um, he is making new friends and uh, new staff, but there's a lot of familiar faces at the Cavaliers from his childhood as well, and he is having a great time. I can't wait to see their show. I've listened to a couple of podcasts that their designers have done recently, and it just sounds so, so cool. Avery's having the time of his life, and so I can't wait to be with him in a couple of weeks to see it all come together for him. Avery is a junior at the University of Alabama. He's an environmental science major, but he also plays marimba with the Million Dollar Band. Next, we have our daughter, Piper. Piper is 18 and just graduated from Seven Lakes High School. She actually graduated on Wednesday and left on Friday morning, first thing, to go for her second season in the color guard of the Blue Devils. Piper had a great first season, obviously, with the Blue Devils. They are her family. The members and staff are just uh, a perfect match for her. We are so excited for her to be back again with them. Their show is perfect for her to a T. Um, I cannot wait to see what Scott Chandler and the whole team can put together for 2023. Piper uh, will also be attending the University of Alabama following in her brother's footsteps where she will be a pre-physical therapy major um, with some emphasis in kinesiology and exercise science and will also be a member of the Million Dollar Band Color Guard. So we're excited for Piper to start in her journey of college. Uh, once she finishes with DCI, she'll go straight uh, back to Tuscaloosa and start college uh, band camp and all of those things. So super busy time for her, but very, very exciting. My name is Stephanie and I serve mainly as a volunteer in the summer in support of wherever I can. I like to spend as much time with my kids as possible and will follow them around. So this summer, I will get to do a week in Laramie, uh, Wyoming for spring training for the Blue Devils. There I'll be fitting and altering core costumes um, and anything else that might come across my plate while I'm there. Then I'll come home and then back for the Cavaliers 75th Gala. I'll get to see Avery um, in his element. And then at the same time, the net very next day is a show in Lyle, Illinois, where the Colts and the Cavaliers will be there. So I get to see both in action, which is super fun. And then a couple of days on the road with the Colts, then back home. And um, about a week later after that, I'll go back on the road with the Blue Devils where I'll be working in the food truck, probably altering some uniforms because that's about the time that everybody starts slimming down, alter some uniforms again, and then back home after a week on the road again. Um, and then I'm super lucky, and I know a lot of people don't have this, but uh, all three cores are going to come to the Houston show. So Colts, Cavaliers, and Blue Devils for the very first time will all be at the Houston show and then San Antonio the next day. So I can take you behind the scenes in Houston and San Antonio, followed a couple of weeks later 
by Indianapolis and the 2023 DCI World Championships. I'll be on location the entire time, taking you every place that I go, showing you the inside scoop with DCI um, from those three course perspective, and more importantly, from my perspective as a parent. So subscribe and join along with us. Um, if you have questions, I'm always open to answer them or something that you'd just like to know or that you think would be cool to see. Let me know and I'll do it for you. So welcome to 2023 DCI with the Quicks.